Hey, what up? This is Shizzle. Uh, this is how Shizzle opens with his videos all the time. What up? This is Shizzle. And so I put uh, this comment that Shizzle made in uh, one of my videos. Uh, made me do this graphics here. It's all done by me. Uh, and, and also in 3D. So, but mm, let's talk about it. So he, so he says, you know. After I showed, you know, the swallows, you know, yeah, it's the swallows, you remember the swallows, guys. <laughs> Beautiful. So I remember the swallows, and, uh, and you know, she's a after seeing that video where the m mama or father swallow cleans the ass, wipes the ass of the baby swallow that just put, you know. And he says, human mothers and fathers are too busy leaving their children with strangers and doing what they are told by leaders. Obey and the leaders will let you feed your children. And so I just remember what happened uh, with the moron. <coughs> the moron, as you can see, is this one here. This is my father. So this is a 3D uh, representation of my father. So uh, we were on the garden, working in the garden there. And for the first time, I saw these beautiful little cats, you know. Here, here's, here are the little cats. Can you see? Yeah, as you can see. The little cats are here. And uh, the... I saw also the mother giving them, uh, she just took some bone in some trash somewhere, you know, and, and took them because her instinct is, you know, to, to find food and to give to her little children, you know. And so my father told me, <laughs> I'm even ashamed to say my father, the moron told me, don't, don't give, don't give confidence to them. What? I was just... My heart just w was filled, you know, with this beauty of the mother, the beautiful cats, you know, that were seeing me, kind of, kind of afraid at the first time. But then, after they realized I was smiling, they, they were playing around, you know. And the mother, you know, the mother, guys, I've never seen such. Th the eyes, the, uh, uh, she was calm, you know, after she realized that I was not a threat, you know. And you can see her, you know, closing her her eyes like slowly, you know. And watching, you know, just like a human, you know, amazing. And on the other, I, I had on my back the moron telling me, don't, don't watch them, don't smile at them, don't give confidence to them. <laughs> because then, then they, they, you know, the cats would ruin the garden, you know, would eat our stuff. You moron, the cats do not eat grass, you moron. <laughs> uh, 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 even, even better, the cat would, would poo. And it's better for it's uh, fertilizing the the soil, you know. But again, guys, I don't even consider him anymore, you know. And so what happens, guys? This was beautiful. That's why I'm showing to you, Shizzle, what happened is if you ever watch this video, the moron at some point got angry with me that I was, you know, being nice to them, you know, not not going there and touching or uh, caressing or whatever, just you know. While working, I would just look at them and smile, you know. I would say, get it, get it, chicka, 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 you know. And so the moron comes with the intention to scare them. And this is what happened. That's why I, I, it took time, you know, to make this representation because I went to a website that has like 3D models of almost anything you can imagine. And you can like take a, a, a screenshot of them at the position you want and so all the elements you see here are done by some sheeple you know graphic designer 3d designer you know, and put there online you know and with this way you know I can create whatever environment that I have in mind with 3d models place them you know well, the best way you can draw them, but since you have 3D models, you know, it's easier for me that, you know, I can, I, I'm not a, a great uh, d d d d uh, drawer. How do you, drawer? No, it's, it's not the right word. Um, drawer? No. 
you 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 understand. And so here is, uh, I, you know, I put on the, on that side, you know, give me a, a 3D uh, fat farmer. I told him. fat farmer, and, uh, nothing came up. And so I said, okay, fat worker, you know, because he was working there. And this came, this this gay shit came. came. <laughs> Uh, I said, oh, you know what, I will use this for my father, he is my father, guys. And so he went, she is a listen, this was beautiful, he went with the intention to scare the cats. And the mother, the, the, the little cats went away. The mother didn't move at all, she is a, nothing, not one inch. And just stayed like that, watching the moron. And I told him, Moron, don't even try it, she will tear you apart. It's on her instincts. Only humans are so moron to give their children to the to the serpents. Only we. Only this animal is the most dumb one that would never fight for their children. On the other hand, them? Guys, have you seen even a bird would fight to death if someone touches their little ones, you know? And what the the morons do not realize, you know, the human animal doesn't realize is that uh, they do not belong, the 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 children do not be belong to them. That's why they can. And I will show you later, you know. And I will uh, uh, say even that not even our body belongs to us anymore. Because, you know, they say that, oh, but if you have the virus, you know, oh, you cannot do whatever you want with your body. Oh. So bye-bye, because they are, of course, against all kinds of uh, private property. And, and the, the ultimate private property that everybody has is their body. And no, uh, not even that is yours anymore when you are asleep. So let's go to the... Uh, and so you know, I was I put this popcorn thing, you know, and, and because it came to my mind, you know, it's like you know, you know, there are some some uh, corn that do not pop, you know, not all of them pop, you know. And so what what I'm saying with this is like they consider us humans, you know, that we appear as human, you know, uh, all like this seed, you know, of of corn. And what happens is there are two kinds of, of seeds there, some that will pop and some that will not. The one that will pop, or you say pop, are the sheeple. But with some of us it doesn't work. We, we don't pop, pop. We don't, we don't pop. And because we are of a different seed, you know, so this is explanation. I, I need an applause right now, but I don't have my sound effects and everything because this computer will die. And so while searching uh, this uh, this popcorn shit, you know, look what I found, guys. Now you might say it is not real. It's real. We d we don't know and everything, you know. I gotta work, man. It's gonna work. No, I can't. You believe? Come on. So have a little faith there. Oh yeah. Huh? Because the fox, the fox checkers. <laughs> Said that this is not, this matter. is BS. It's I'm telling it's you, it's work. Good. Just put so, so they are four uh, people that have uh, two numbers, you know. And so, with one phone, they call the other phone and they lay the four phones in a cross there with some popcorn seed, you know, uh, mice. How do you call it? Corn. Uh, and so, they try this with. Uh, let, let me play this 20. 20. Okay, 20. 20. It's not working. It's gonna work. Give it no. a second. Here it goes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh no! Oh, hey, hey. That's crazy. Oh, oh that's too much. Uh, I told you. No way, yeah. man. So, guys. Jeez, yeah. So, guys. These are other four morons that are trying this. You know, the the, the mystery would uh, would be solved if we <laughs> just do it ourselves. You know? But do we have? Uh, I, I barely have one phone. But I imagine this could be the case, you know, it might be real, you know, and so if, uh, if four cell phones, you know, do this to a popcorn, you know, like make it pop, imagine what the next generation. <laughs>
Oh, <laughs> 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 it looks like a table there, guys. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe they are hitting them with some, with some radiation. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. And the, the here we have also in China, they have done the same. And of course, they... <laughs> they <laughs> Yeah. Here you go. Here and they will. Oh, popcorn and beautiful. You put that in your head. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Sure. What's next? So from time to time and time and time again. Oh, uh, some some tranny will pass, <laughs> and you will vomit. It's not my intention to make you vomit, but, or maybe yes, you know, just to make you. So, uh, I finally liberated myself from this moron, you know, because he he cooks here, guys, and so he would like uh, be. I will be his slaves, his slave. For example, if I told him, you know, but, but why are you cooking with filthy hands or shit like this, you know, he would uh, just like boss me, you know. And so, and so I uh, gave up that uh, that service of his, you know, and I and I said to him, no, you, I don't want uh, your stuff anymore. I will cook by myself, which is I, I never cook. You know, I, I just eat something that I find. You know, I find a way to just to survive, guys. I just have to fill my my stomach, and it's not important food for me. And so. What happens now? I'm, I'm so liberated, guys, and I'm saying you this, guys, because everything that uh, you are uh, dependent uh, on, you know, will make you a slave, you know. And so, guys, so 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 much shit I had to go through because this moron would cook for me. It, it was hell, guys. Just because and, and just because, ah, but I cooked for you, so you would, ah, you don't, how dare you, ah, you know. This is when you are served, you know, you are a slave. Now it's it's been like two, three days that I'm not eating his stuff anymore. What a liberation, guys. And uh, what I do, I go every day in this uh, spot here, in the mountain, and I take f take uh, wood from the from the trees there. And this is a picture I took just uh, today with a beautiful butterfly. You know, because we gotta listen to something there, you know, because I, I usually stop there because it's a, a hike, you know, it's very hard, you know, to get there. And you know, guys, unbelievable the wood that you, that I get from this small patch of trees that there is there. Because as you can see here, it's it's mostly uh, uh, like grass, but with some isles, islands, so to speak, of trees, small isolated isles of trees here and there you know? and I'm on one of these so I can stay in the sh shade you know and it's it's uh, good you know it's not cold it's not uh, warm and but the beauty is that I'm I'm still on this bunch of trees you know which is very small you know but it's amazing th that keeps giving me wood you know and I'm not cutting of course the the, the trees that are still uh, alive of course, just the dead trees, you know, that are, and also, and also, remember that you you you, you cannot just take whatever trees there because if they are rotten, you know, it's not good. You also uh, fill your house with uh, ants and stuff, and, and the wood will not burn for long if it's rotten, you know, even if it's dry. But if it's rotten, you know, it doesn't work, and so. Even I have to, to choose between the dead trees there, and yet it keeps giving me lots of wood, guys. Amazing the, the resources that there are there, guys. And um, and I will link this with the, the situation of the swallows. M many of you are asking right now, what is the situation with the swallows? Here's the situation with the swallows, guys. Now all the babies got out. Here, here they are all babies, guys. Believe it or not. These are all baby swallows. And I... Uh, shoot them with 160 frames per second so you'll see them really really like slowly look how they beat their wings 
and flap their wings like this because mommy is coming. Look, but mommy chose that other one there. And look, he just got the bug with you know, the mother just hitting him with, you know. In this way, you can see every move that you look. The mother is coming, or father, I don't know. Look, look, he got the bug, you know. Just like the sheep who got the bug. And uh, and it's really beautiful, guys, to see them. Uh, this is the first day that they're like they are shaking their head and they are almost falling because they it's the first day. They look, <laughs> they are totally you know lost. It's the f their first day. Look, they are eating iron. You know, they see something they, they want to eat it. You know, look, they are uh, scratching and uh, flexing their wings because their muscles are not ready yet. You know, look, the other one shake his head and almost fall fell. You know. <laughs> And so you know, guys, look what happened. Uh, differently from us, you know, because this was yesterday, guys. But today, no, it's like two days that I'm not seeing them anymore, guys, because they just grew up here where I live, you know. So, so I, I, I took all these beautiful sh shots you know, and everything, you know? and then and then they left, guys. Uh, uh, even even the parents, so these are the the chicks, you know. Look, they are so so stupid, you know. They they want to eat like iron. There, look, he will try. Let me try this. And what is? is it the, they don't have, don't have the experience, you know. And so what happens? But they already can fly. What happens? The mother and the father, uh, they do not sleep anymore in this nest that they had here near my house. They went away maybe to build another house for them, you know, in another place. And uh, and this is, you know, this animal is more free than us. You cannot do that. I'm living 40 years old with my father, guys. This is the situation of the human animal, fortunately. Let me show you the last one. That's bit that's uh, the mother coming. Look. Look how beautiful. This is a baby. Eh? Beautiful. This is me singing like a bird. Amazing. This one was very cool to stay there. Just sitting. Where's the mother? Here's me. Uh. <laughs> Look, like do this. You see some some bird or whatever they do that. <laughs> There's three of them here, and there were like six of them. The whole nest, you know. And so here's the story, then an update on the swallow. So now. Now, let me go ahead as I <laughs> to the next. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> I'm just a girl in my world <laughs> with a six pack of a man. Oh, yeah, you are also very beautiful. So, do you know that in UK, guys, you can uh, uh, be naked in the public? It's legal here. Sir. Ah, will you join the topless revolution? Ah, revolution. Revolution, sheep. You are wearing the muzzle, but ah, this is a revolution. So some, uh, so it's it's perfectly legal to be naked in public in the UK. What is not legal and blah blah blah. So uh, it's legal, but but not to to go without the muzzle. This is uh, a brave new world. Uh, so here it says. We are declaring ownership of our bodies. So if you want to be destructive and dumb, you know, they let you do it. But if you want to get ownership of your, of your body, uh, you know, to not get killed, you know, ah, that's not good. That's not good. And, uh, and they also, let's put some man bashing also while we are at it, you know. So it's men who stop women wanting to be topless. So you know they will say in this article like, ah, oh, we are not free to do it because there are these perverts watching you. Are you mar? You showing me your tits? What do you expect me to do, you dumb moron? You morons! 
The morons are are starting the revolution while with topless, you know, while being with the muzzle. This, this is how they fool the sheeple, guys. This is how stupid they are. Look at this other train, guys. All lost, you know. <laughs> Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, so. am, am I good enough? Yes, you are beautiful. Oh, look, look at you. Are you, were you a soccer player before you changed socks? Huh? Ah, do you know, guys, that um, the poop just pooped really hard, and you know they got some problems in his colon, and so they. Uh, or maybe uh, you know he 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 was playing with his with his, his partner you know and got some s big d d dick you know in his ass and 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 he he was, he is sad as you can see so they say to us you know maybe, maybe uh, they are just uh, playing with us you know doctor explains uh, the poops colon uh, procedure went fine uh, everything went fine so the poop was uh, operated it was. Uh, in, in operation room, you know, uh, with the ass on the air, you know, and and some dude, you know, just opened his ass and operated him because he damaged his asshole too many dicks. You know. And so I was thinking, you know, uh, there was this this uh, band called uh, Black Eyed Peas, guys. Black Eyed Peas, and I remember, you know, that the the, the poop also. Uh, got this uh, black eye, you know, and and many of them of these pedos, you know, got their uh, their uh, black eyes, you know. And so I said to myself, oh, maybe that band, you know, the black eyed peas, you know, are the black eyed peas, the pedophiles, you know. So and, and you know, I said to myself, let me see this band, you know. Uh, they have the Templar cross here. Clearly, I don't know if you can see it, guys. Temple cross and the octagon, they really love the eight point pointed star, you know. And, uh, and they say here, the end with this uh, muzzle looks like a mask to me because there's eyes behind this, you know. Uh, this album is uh, programming the sheeple, you know, that uh, after when we put the muzzle on you, it's over, you morons. And one of them is called William, but since they think they are God, you know, they, they he, his artist name, he's changed it with uh, Will I Am, you know, the I Am, you know, God, you know. Amazing, masters of the sun, of Lucifer. Uh, yeah, no you, no, you are not masters of Lucifer, you are the slaves of, of Lucifer, you dumb morons. And here we have the this pyramid and, and everything. And that's the usual six, six, six. And, uh, but again, uh, there's a difference. If I make it, guys, I'm a, I'm a nobody. So don't don't be stupid. This was a gesture in Albania, guys. Albania, me, me, in Albania, guys. If you do something like this, you are saying to someone, "If I get you, you, know, I will do this and this and this." I mean, the gestures and the and the expression in Albania, guys. If you take that out. Albanians, guys, uh, you know, b because when you are communicating, uh, the just thirty percent is, or maybe even less, is what you say. Seventy uh, percent is uh, how you say it. You know, the gestures, the way you, the tone of voice, and everything. You know. So maybe, for example, someone that doesn't understand English can kind of understand me what I'm saying just by the way my voice is going. Ah, look at this! Ah! It's it's. it's you can understand even if I you don't understand what I'm saying, you, you can understand that I'm making fun of the uh, of this moron here, for example. And so, of course, uh, there is some some phoenix here, of course, uh, to, to to give some you know uh, to, to tell you know to the master. Uh, yes, master, I, here's your here's where I put you on. And of course, you gotta have some training, you know, because you know the, uh, you gotta program the morons, you know, with the training. And tits and everything. You know? So I remember, guys, l when uh, l l democracy came and hit Albanians, you know, in the 
you know, I, I lived all the 80s in Albania, guys, and then as soon as the beautiful 90s and the, the liberation of uh, Albania came, <laughs> liberation, just like Americans do and uh, uh, export uh, democracy everywhere, uh, the same happened with Albania, but it happened in the 90s. So in the beginning of the 90s. And so we got the, our, our, you know, taste of, uh, of of Western countries, culture, with music and MTV and everything just came out of nowhere. And, and we would listen. And I remember there was this song in uh, uh, by this Italian singer called uh, whatever, Toto Cutugno, uh, that had this uh, uh, very... Um, well, we were dumb at that point. We didn't know what Europe was. You know, yes, we knew Europe. You know, but, you know, we didn't... Uh, I, especially, because the morons were dumb, of course didn't know what the program was with all this, you know. And um, and just before I start saying this, guys, let, let me sh show you just um, uh, what is y Europe, guys, you know, S just quickly. Sustainable development. Simply put, sustainable development is an environmental... Sustainable development. Simply put, sustainable development is an environmental philosophy which holds that the human population is a resource to be managed by a global elite. Now, of course, those of us in the biblical tradition believe that the human population, human population consists of individuals who have received their rights from God. But from the United Nations perspective, the human population is just one factor that must be kept in equilibrium in this democratic biosphere. Man has no ascendancy in nature. Humankind is just another species with rights that are no more significant than those of plants or other animals. Okay, so, and then the, the, the other one I'll put at the end. So, of course, uh, since they realize it, you know, to, to, uh, to make them dumb and everything, you know, and you use just television, you know. And so you had all these whores, they promoted these singers and everything, you know. And so this song was uh was co talking about europe like this is this is beautiful thing you know and, and it was the 90s i was in albania guys i didn't know what was this and so apparently there was this eurovision guys contest you know uh that they used to program the ship and then and this eurovision thing has started in the 1956 guys very long ago as soon as they they did the war with us you know Ah, uh, they needed also to program us with the culture and everything. And so they started with propaganda in the 50s, uh, 56. And, um, and in the 90s, this guy won, this Italian guy won, uh, in 1990. Uh, with the song called, mm, here's six years ago, sorry. <laughs> sorry, who cares? Uh, with the song uh, called Insieme which uh, I have here also the translation. Look at the words, guys. Ah, uh, together. So, unite, unite Europe, it goes the song, you know. So, with you, uh, he, uh, the, uh, the moron singing. So far and different, with you, a friend that I thought I lost, you and I, so I, I will not sing the song anymore, uh, having the same dream, we and I having the same, he's talking about the, the other people of Europe, you know merging the sheep, you know, together, unite, unite, Europe, a and for you, a woman without borders, you know, a whore, I and mean, just, you know, migrants all, all your life, you know, with you under the same flags, uh, you and I under the same sky of Lucifer, together, unite, unite, Europe, we are more and more free, <laughs> no longer a dream, and you are no longer alone. We are higher and higher. Uh, give me your hand so we can fly. Uh, Europe is not far away. This is an Italian song for you. Together, unite, unite, Europe. For us in heaven, a thousand violins, a thousand points of light. Huh? For us, love without borders. Yeah. You and I have the same ideals. Mm. Together, uniting at Europe. We are more and more free and blah, blah, blah. Hold my hand, united. Huh? 
Amazing, yes. Europe is not far away. And this was the night, this guys, you know, United, United Europe. So this was propaganda, guys. Uh, and, and and Eurovision, uh, the the when it was some some years ago, you know, th this one, uh, this. Uh, so uh, of course they, they have to promote the destructive sheeple kind of sheeple, you know. And so they promote this uh, he, this moron here won. Uh, this one won. Of course, you know, uh, but they realize that they just have to say to the sheeple to kill themselves, and they will do it. And so they they tell them, uh, "Look, be like this and more," and uh, and they will do it. And and uh, and uh, and and uh, the the moron won with uh, with a, a title called "Arise Like a Phoenix." I mean, not even the the lyrics are theirs, guys, because it's very you know, clear. You know, "Arise Like a Phoenix" is very masonic, you know, and it says you're. Out of the ashes, seeking rather than revenge. Retribution for the tranny. You were warned. Once I'm transformed, once I'm reborn, I rise up to the sky. You threw me down, but I'm gonna fly and rise like a phoenix. And uh, the last one in this Aerovision context uh, w was this. Uh, filthy morons uh, that will just snorting cocaine live you know just promoting the most destructive kind of sheeple and uh, and that's what what they do you know here are the morons the uh, one you know uh, this moron also thinks he's god you know he's put, put jesus here in his leg here of course and he has also death here in his tattoo but i showed this in another and the serpent of course in another one that i did and I was seeing, you know, uh, the uh, the logos that the Aerovision had during the years, you know, from 56 to today, you know, it still goes on until they are killed all the sheep, you know, the ones that are not dumb enough to kill themselves, you know. And so this was the logo of the 82 version, which is the Rosicrucian logo just there, you know. Uh, this one was the uh, cre uh, Celebrate the Diversity in 2017. Celebrate Diversity. Uh, this one says, uh, come together with some kind of a virus here. You know, they were programming us in 2016. Yeah? Then we got uh, building bridges in 2015. Then we got some, well, this is, what is, like, uh, like a dino or something. So join us, you know, join in on this. Uh, or so cross here you can see here guys and uh, and the, the, the best of them all some MK Ultra you know symbology uh, uh, programming yeah we are one of course and uh, with a butterfly you know they are they are changing from a worm you know they are becoming the butterfly and then someone will stomp on this butterfly butterfly and they are butter morons and uh, have no idea they're being used, you know. And so, I, uh, Facebook is, is is a concentration of morons, guys. And so they will just, you know, you know, the the, uh, the reptilians, you guys, you know, are th just like you know that rat in which which is experimented upon, you know, that doesn't have no idea he's in a, in this cage and people are out there are playing on him, you know. And so, from time to time, the reptilians throw us some, some, something to talk about, you know, and to get angry about, you know. So that just to, to, to see the reaction of the morons, you know. And uh, what they are showing in this one, saying that ah, oh, this uh, woman here is uh, uh, wants that uh, children to have sex with animals and uh, and to change their sex and whatever, you know. So while the genocide is going on, guys, they make them fight for, for BS that it's not even... I mean, of course they program the, the children and everything, but, but the thing that they don't realize, the, 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 the parents the, of the human animal doesn't realize, is that they, their children are not theirs. Their children, as soon as they, as they are born, you know, they get to be signed up as a sh new sheep came in this farm number 
uh, some bites from the serpent, up to 80 times bites of the serpent. That is not yours. Then they go in the school and they get more programming there. That is not your property. And if you dare to tell them not to bite, the, not to let them bite, you know, the, the vaccine that they get, guys, when they are born, up to 80 times, and then they go to school. If you refuse both of these things, you know, to let them vaccinate, to let them tag them with the number and the, and the name and the everything, a certificate of birth and everything, and to not to put them in school, they will, they will put you in jail, moron. So the children is not yours. Forget it, moron. But since they are brain dead guys, the the elite themselves, the reptilians themselves, provide them something to make them feel that oh we are in control of our children. I mean after 2020 guys there's nothing to talk about about the sheep. They are total not even animals guys as I showed even the cat will fight you know I mean the cat guys were as I showed in the image guys the cat was like one one tenth of my of the moron here and yet would not move would not move just like I do with this moron you know and this is what humans should do guys they should not get scared of the bully guys unfortunately and again, and get this shizzle. But the ones that are popable, you know, the sheeple, I say are, are of another seed. And this has helped me to understand the sheeple shizzle. Because once you realize that, you realize that they have no shame. They are different from us. And, and, and you will say, but uh, we too might do something crazy, like uh, crazy things that uh, that are not very humane to do, you know. But to us, it hurts more than to the sheeple. They have no uh, uh, shame because they are of another seed. So it's very important to understand this, uh, Shizel. Uh, and what differentiates us from them is that when we do something uh, shitty, you know, that we know deep inside is bad, you know, we the the frequency that we do that thing is very smaller than what the sheeple will do they will do it all the time without caring but us we might do it but we will feel bad after we do it this shows shows you that you are of this other seed and and yes they are all of the serpent you might say but from you know like the big reptilian to the little sheep Yes, they are all of the serpent, but depending on where they are positioned in this pyramid, you know, they are all, all, all of them are all the followers, all of them, from the small sheep to the big reptilian there. They are all following some orders in this system, all of them. But it just happens that some of them might be a politician, some of them is just uh, swiping uh, the floor in, in the streets. Some of them is uh, 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 controlling, uh, really controlling the system and everything. But even them, uh, higher up, they are, you know, they have to get in contact with the demons telling them what to do and everything, you know. They have to sacrifice, to give them sacrifice and everything. So all of us, all of these serpents are f order followers, all of them. But depending on where they are put in the pyramid of this system, they can do more or less harm, you know? but all of them are pieces of shit. And since there are lots of them, the result is the shit that we see around us. But at the end, you know, this this system, the way it's, it, it, it's set up, you know, is a system that slowly will get rid of this of this small serpents at the bottom. But slowly, slowly, to all of it, even to the bot, to, to the top one, you know, this demon that controls them, you know, Lucifer, some call it or whatever, this amazing power that, that tells them what to do to be so evil, you know, at some point they will get rid of all of them. But this, since they are moron, they do not get it, because their nature is that of wanting to fight, wanting to 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 be evil, and so 
There's no way she's able to save these people. Don't do not even try. Unfortunately, I have realized this, and it's it's been very calm for me to 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 to, to realize this. So we were to some shit here. You know me. Yes, we were we were here where this lady was. Uh, yeah. So Sipotra, you can you know have sex and with animals and people of all, of all gender, uh, of all ages. So even pedophilia, they are saying. But they can do whatever they want with their children, man. Whatever they want, whatever is destructive, but it kills you and destroys the family and and everything here, they will do it. And they have the serpents that are ready to take the job to 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 do that. Orders are very up, very higher up, and uh, are uh, super, super uh, su how do you say? Supernatural, so to speak, in, in nature. Nature. So, uh, so this image, guys, is in one of uh, you know. Th this was the video that got millions of views in my channel, guys. Was talking about propaganda in uh, Albania, guys, and of course. YouTube got it uh, deleted all my channel but this shows you guys how fearful the sheeple are of the social pressure guys so look this is in a factory guys in Albania during communism you had the best productive sheep and then at the bottom you, ha you have the worst the one that didn't work enough was slow and so they, they put him with the uh, how do you call this animal, this slow animal? Yeah. Tartaruga. Turtle. A turtle, you know, very slow. And look, look what he did. One of them, you know, this is a picture that uh, a, a guy, you know, uh, this was a French photographer, went in Albania during communism. This was amazing because we didn't have photographers, guys. We were very poor and everything. You know. There was photographers there that would take a picture of you, but you would go in their studio and there are very few maybe just one in the whole town where i lived you know and for some sometimes they would even you know go you know out the studio to a, a place in the city center you know to take a picture of you and with some sta statue or you know, in the grass or whatever but it's very rare and so and this is a social pressure guys the one that uh, uh, got the l l last position, you know, was slower in, in, in his job, you know. Instead of, you know, being proud, oh, you Mars, you know, I, I took the money that they give me, but I didn't work like like more like you, you know. Uh, no, he, he was ashamed of himself and he just, you know, removed the paper, you know, trying to not... So people do not see that he didn't work, he wasn't a good slave. So I'm showing you this, guys, because, you know, this is uh, how strong the the, 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 the the social pressure is right now to take the, the cure. Because the nature of the sheep will never change. This is their nature. As you can see here, where's my hand? So this is how fearful I, uh, they are of being seen as a no-vaxxer, no for example. And they would do anything, they would just erase themselves. He is removing his himself from that, you know. Because it's very painful for them guys, the, the eyes of the other sheep. They are they are very weak guys. They want to please every, every time the herd. Alright, so now let's try and sorry guys. <laughs> nothing to do. There's nothing to do. I can't believe it guys, we just arrived at the end and I will close close this with this uh, other half that I wanted to uh, talk about this beautiful uh, Europe and United Nations and everything. So see you in the next one guys and uh, leave you with this. God created mankind in two complementary sexes and joined them together in a family which was meant to perpetuate itself and the family was instructed to multiply and replenish the earth. Now, the United Nations, on the other hand, proceeds from the assumption that the Earth itself is divine, that man is, at very best, a product of the machinations of an impersonal and indifferent 
process of evolution, that we have not received rights from God, that our rights are social artifacts to be granted to us by the state, that mankind was not given dominion over nature, but rather is simply an unassuming part of nature, that we were not created in two definitive sexes, but rather the undifferentiated mass of humanity can occupy any number of socially constructed gender roles, that the family itself is a social artifact which can be manipulated and changed at will. And of course, the worst thing we can do from the United Nations perspective is to multiply and replenish the earth. So guys, I just want to leave you with that. That clip was uh, taken from uh, a broadcast in 99, but this one was in 94, I guess. Because they was uh, talking about Rwanda when, in this speech, you know. But you know, yeah, very powerful. They, they would say uh, things that are happening right now, you know, this changing genders and everything, you know, uh, at uh, your wish and everything. It's amazing, in 94, guys. Bill Cooper then was killed in 2001 so see you in the next one guys bye bye